I remember coming down to live in the New Forest and being really struck by this, this thing, which I've, I've said before, but it is like going to Narnia. At first, you get that thing about, God, we've gone through the wardrobe. I mean, you know, you, you walk out on a, on a winter's day and there's frost on the grass and you look up and you see the clear sky and you see the incredible trees and you just think, I have literally gone to Narnia. The best thing about the New Forest is how many different things there are in it. I mean, it has breathtaking scenery. It has wonderful woodlands. It's got all these you know, different uh, villages, each of which have got a very specific character. We're very, very near to the sea. So the New Forest has an amazing range of locations available. For me, the logistics of being able to shoot on one of the stages at the four main studios in the UK, Elstree, Warner Brothers Studios, Leavesden, Shepperton and Pinewood, and then 90 minutes be on location in the New Forest is just fantastic. I go to London to work at the BBC and I go in three or four times a week, it takes an hour and a half. It's as connected as you'd want anywhere to be, but whilst also having that impression that you're in the middle of a vast amount of unexplored open space. I mean, we've shot documentaries and promos here and, you know, shot loads of them and no two of them look the same. We've shot uh, footage on open roads that are meant to look like American roads. I have a, an old American car. We've taken photographs of that car that people have been convinced we've been in Utah for. I mean, because, you know, great flat open vistas, big skies, you know, sandy underfoot. It looks like you're in a desert. I remember the crew coming down, one being amazed by how easy it was to get here from, you know, from London or from Manchester or from Edinburgh or wherever it is. Secondly, how easy it was to find accommodation. And thirdly, how easy it was to shoot in. We work really closely with the New Forest District Council and they've just got a really positive, can-do approach to filming requests. They make things simple, they get things done. What you need if you're doing location scouting is you need a number of places next door to each other. On one hand, you've got historic buildings. You know, here we are in Beaulieu, we're at Palace House. This is a historic, uh, you know, building. Within 20 minutes from here, you have inland water, you have the sea, you have castles, you have open land with big skies, you have very dense forest. Find me somewhere else in the UK that has all those things literally cheap by jowl. That's the advantage of being in the forest. It's got a fairy tale quality to it, and there is no question that it does have that. I think the only problem with saying that the forest has a fairy tale quality is it suggests that that's the only thing it has. It is fantastical, it is Narnia, but it is also a lot of other things as well.